Hey there everyone. So this time around I'll be reviewing two different books uh, both meant for um, theoretical for children at least. Uh, the first being Mythical Mazes, a collection of amazing mythical mazes and the second is uh, Chanda Mama celebrating 60 wonderful years, a collector's edition. So I got both of them second hand so they are a little bit up like this one has a slightly t slight tear on the uh, on the spine but other than that they are uh, in pretty good condition so let's start with uh, mythical mazes so i actually bought this book for my sister <laughs> but i couldn't give it to her because i love this book too much and why i love this book i'll show you but before that um, i'll just give you the blurb at the back so you can pause it and uh, read it there and yeah let's open it up so that's the cast as to who is illustrated by who is retold by and so on so I'll show you why this is second it's a second hand book so says Joe Natalie Merry Christmas December 98 so Someone apparently sold this book, uh, so Joe <laughs> got it uh, for Christmas in 98, I got it, got this book apparently, I think a few years back, uh, so yeah, so I'll give you the introduction as well, you can pause it and read that there, and this is the uh, content, so why this is a, uh, children's book this is why so this is the reason it's a children's book the the uh, descriptions are very short the reason why I love this book is because of the illustrations see the illustrations so this is from Thor I'll give you another illustration maybe Sedna this the bird spirit so look at this illustration it's beautiful I mean really lovely illustration and all of the pages have so varied kind of illustrations so for example this one so i have no idea which is a sigurd yeah sigurd the dragon i think this is from uh, viking mythology knots i think so celtic knots and let's cover one more maybe yeah theseus greek Theseus and the Minotaur. So beautiful illustration. I mean, this actually works as a maze. I know the namesake of the book is Mythical Mazes, but the quality of illustration in this book is really breathtaking, in my opinion. And and the the words are pretty large and uh, very nicely spaced for children to read as well. So. I know that this is a this is supposed to be a children's book, but I couldn't <laughs> give it away. Sir Gawain, the Green Knight. So this is from Arthurian Legends, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, it's from Arthurian Legends. So look at this maze. Beautiful maze. I I I, I love this book. So that is the reason I decided to uh, review it. So there's a black on the back. And yeah that's mythical mazes a very simple book but one i think is lovely so definitely worth uh, worth keeping in your collection this chanda mama so uh, people who have grown up with chanda mama probably know this but in case you don't know uh, it's a it's a collection of indian uh, folk tales over the years retold uh, by by this uh, by this um, uh, this it used to come out as a magazine at one point of time but then it stopped Chanda Mama stopped so this is basically a 60 year uh, collector's edition of Chanda Mama so it's in the form of a so it's not a portrait book it's basically a landscape book so that's the content is there a blurb though? I don't think there's a blurb, but there's a there's an introduction if I'm not a forward I mean. Let's see this. No, there's no blurb at the back either. It's 
says the price is 449 but I don't think you'll get it at 449 because this has already gone out of print if I'm not wrong and um, it's pretty hard to get get this any anymore so forward stacks of manually bound copies so there's a picture here so it, it, it contains a, an interesting history of Chandamama and how it came about a few pictures from so that there's Indira Gandhi there a few pictures from the run time and so on and then it opens out to the okay so regional language i think this is tamil maybe or i'm not very sure i'm uh, not at all versed in uh, south indian language so i have no idea <coughs> so yeah let's open this book up vikram vetal stories and it has the original illustrations from the original uh, chanda mama so Prince and the Gundar was published in 2007. So the original illustrations for Chandamama are preserved in there, and I think this is a that's a that's a very good um, benefit. And then you have uh, the name of the uh, name of the story here at the top with the different genres which represent which are represented by the story. And, and it's divided into different uh, sections for example so you th this section goes on into adventures and explorations I think that's a very interesting choice so the first one was Vikram Vetal second one go goes into adventure the genre changes but Vikram Vetal well in a sense it's a genre because it, it has very large number of stories in Vikram Betal. So from the Vikram Betal, the first section was the second section contains adventures and then you have I have no idea which story which story is this? Cast Away by Choice. Published in 2007 it says again. And then let's go on to humor. So here we have a story, Buntu Survives Poison. I think these illustrations are very nice. So this one was published in 2000 for example. The previous two stories I showed were from 2007. A Game of Chess, this is also in humor. And then there are nuggets of information throughout the book in different parts of the stories. And finally you go on into moral stories. So interesting nuggets on Chandamama's publication and uh, different information. And the illustrations as you can see are reminiscent of the old Chandamama uh, issues that we used to see at previously like in my childhood i haven't read chanda mama too many too many of chanda mama but um, the ones the few that i had read i remember them being having the same kind of illustrations and at the end there are photographs visitors at bnk press and then automatic building department binding department and then there's so art gallery so art gallery has cover cover art from the different chanda mamas throughout the years and finally it ends i think it's a wonderful book especially since it's a collector's edition 60 years collector's edition so yeah
two books this time. Uh, no idea how to, how to. Yeah, two books this time. And as always, if you have any comments, anything to say, uh, any anything to ask, feel free to comment in the comment section down below. And yeah, happy reading.